Yeah. Three, two, one. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back. I'm Rasmus. And my name's Emil. Today we are continuing the format where we are finding cool and inspiring people and we are elevating their hairstyle and style. Today we are visiting René, he's a professional kayaker and he won several of medals in both the Olympics and the World Championship. I've heard he is uh, preparing his kayak inside. Alright, let's go <laughs> and check Get out to what he's up to. <laughs> Hello Rene. Oh hey. Good to see you. Rene, good to see you. So what's up? You ready for training? <laughs> I'm trying to be. Are you excited to go for a swim or oh, want to stay in the we, boat? We, we, we <laughs> hope that we can uh, tr try to sit in one of those. I've got some easier ones. <laughs> you can try and sit in this one, but uh, so it's difficult to balance this one. There's a two-second rule. It's a usual bet from that we always do with people who are like, oh I can do it. And then we're like, oh yeah, let's try and some stupid bed or something and then it looks super fast those kayaks i have been trying earlier was a little bit uh, wider yeah yeah, yeah 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 and usually inflatable ones yeah. full carbon you can try and lift it like this yeah Whoa. it's super light it's how many kilos, kilos 12 kilos 12 kilos can, can you lift, lift it here it in the middle <laughs> It's even lighter. It's eight kilos. <laughs> Rene, nice. we are so happy to have you here on yep. the channel. Um, first, I'd like you to say hi to all of the viewers <laughs> and give them a brief introduction of yourself. I've been paddling in a skinny boat like this for 18 years-ish, maybe 19. Yeah, I've been practicing between 10 and 14 times in the boat every week since I was 12. And you won a few medals as well, right? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> a few. Seven world championship medals, uh, three of them gold, and 20 European medals, six of them gold, one Olympic silver, and European Games, 30 World Cup medals. So today we are going to cut your hair, Rene, yeah. and we're going to style it. And then we also picked out a really nice outfit that you're gonna see later. I think that's very suitable for the next victory when you're going to celebrate that. On the podium. Yeah. <laughs> or on the boat. Yes, on the top podium. Oh, great. That's good. I'm excited for that. That'll be good. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. All right, guys, now we're sitting here in the Kerk storage and we made a pop-up salon and we invited Ulysses. Many of you might remember him from Slick Hair TV. The early days. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're going to uh, elevate your hairstyle. Mm -hmm. We thought about that we should go for six millimeters at the sides and fade it to the top and keep some of the links. What do you think, Ulysses? It's the best that's gonna do this. Cool. All right. So René, when you're a professional athlete, how many hours do you train a day? I'd say between three and a half and five hours, depending on the season and depending on how close we are to competitions. In the off season, it would probably be around four and a half, five and closer to the race in the summertime. It's probably three and a half, four. Try to have higher quality and less volume in the summer. Four hours of training a day. What do you do with the rest of the day? Sleep. Sleeping and eat, massage. Sleep and eat. Sports massage. I wish. <laughs> no. <laughs> sleep, sleep and eat. Sounds very easy to lay on the couch, but there's only so much Netflix. <laughs> exactly. I think a lot of you out there would like to know if Rene were a motorboat, how many horsepowers would he have when he's at his top form? I'm able to produce one horsepower. One horsepower? Yep. Oh, that's crazy. 700. <laughs> it's just over one. I think it's 700 watts you need to produce one horsepower yeah. and I produce 750, 800. And if Emil was about to um, be measured in horsepowers, how much do you think he would <laughs> produce? 0.2 <laughs> maybe? <laughs> Let's see about that. So we have a five time one uh, Emil here in terms of horsepowers. Yeah, and we... Rene is twice as big as me. Yeah. And uh, train two times ten, ten, it Trains ten times more than me. <laughs> <laughs> Before Ulysses finish your haircut, Rene, we would like to know, when did you knew that this is your way of living? Yeah, I started paddling when I was uh, about 12 years old. And before that, I used to watch a lot of Tour de France and see those cyclists. So I actually thought I was going to be cycling. Um, but then I tried kayaking and um, I really like that you, because in kayaking you, in the winter time you do running, 
uh, gym, swimming, like all kinds of sports. So I actually like the variety in the, in the sport and I really enjoyed just training a lot. And I was lucky enough to go into a club where the coach was a bit of a, a bit of a maniac. <laughs> just gave me a lot of training and physic physically I'm pretty lucky from genetically. Yes. So um, I think I was 18, 19 when I, uh, <laughs> When I uh, went to the Olympics, 19, and then I was in there, I was like, okay, I want to be a professional athlete. And also, um, we talked a little bit about your food intake and uh, how many calories a day. <laughs> um, between four and 6,000 calories a day. <laughs> Depending on, like, at the bit. moment, it's probably how only How many family three and pizzas are we talking? I have no idea. <laughs> but maybe, a lot. Maybe some of you know it, you can comment down below. <laughs> I can see Ulysses did a great job, so uh, now it's time to style it. Sit down. <laughs> we have a challenge for you. Uh, <laughs> the master said, sit down. Right, How about a challenge with some uh, kayak first for you guys? Yeah, serious? Yep. I've got two beginner's kayaks you can try, and then we can try uh, and put you in uh, in my kayak after and see how you manage right. that. It's time I'm to pretty, take the I'm guns. Pr I'm, I'm pretty, I'm pretty, I'm pretty <laughs> sure we for can handle it. All or? We can handle it, right? Zero point two, two, two horsepower. Zero point three horsepower. <laughs> <laughs> You're identical. Come on. <laughs> okay, we up for the challenge. Cool. Yep. Ready for a challenge? Looks nice. Super ready. I will have the white one. So I'll go with the yellow, of course. Cool. Um, first things first. Safety. Interesting. Woo! Okay, turn to your left. Competitive people. You think they're gonna fall in the water? Maybe not in these guys, but they will definitely fall in the boat or fall in the water once they get in my boat. Definitely. get up in your boat yeah half the size all right guys are you ready for this challenge the next the, the sure. actual challenge the actual one yeah this what will is be, it about it's basically you're going in the formula one version of uh of a car oh. this is just a kayak instead okay the only way for you guys is to keep the balance is with the paddle tap it no pushing just tap yeah tap if you get that far sure it's pointing uh, direction uh, yeah because i'm not expecting land. you to go too far <laughs> Once you're out, I'll do a countdown for you. <laughs> and then, when I let go, it's your turn. Mm -hmm. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay, Emil. So how can you can you do it better than your brother? I think uh, maybe two seconds. It's going all right. Yeah, good thing I'm holding you, eh? Are you? <laughs> yeah. Yes, I am, obviously. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Oh, wow, pretty good, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it'd be great. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, we have to take second round. Yeah, lower the center of gravity. I'm helping you. Okay. <laughs> you put your paddle on the water. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you can do it. Take it easy. <laughs> nice job. 
Hi, that was an amazing challenge. Yeah, you're I welcome. The, the first part was fun, most fun because we were all dry yeah, during all, the challenge. Yeah, and the, the training first in the, <laughs> what, what is it called, the kayak we started It's a um, touring kayak. It's for, yeah. for just you know, <laughs> regular not, people. Not beginners, but um, something in between. semi-beginner. Yeah. Practiced. Yeah, but even if we uh, thought it was good training, we didn't last more than uh, maybe one second in the professional kayak. I think it would take you about maybe half a year, then you'd actually be able to paddle in it comfortably. Okay. Not in the big waves, but yeah, you'd be comfortable. But as you can see, the water is totally flat. Yeah, it there's couldn't no be a better day to There's uh, to absolutely practice. no excuses. <laughs> <laughs> it's a perfect day for it. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. But uh, now it's time to uh, style your hair and dress you up. Make this look good, hey? Let's do it. Cool. Let's do it. Now we're back here. What an amazing challenge. Now it's our turn to style your hair. You did and pretty good. You, up. You, you were good. Perfect. Around 10, 15 pumps of the pre styling spray. So, Rene. Are you used to blow dry your hair? Never. Never? No, okay. Never. It only takes three minutes in the morning and then your hair will stay up all day long. Yeah, but the thing is I go straight into a kayak and then destroy the whole thing. And all night. <laughs> it will stay up uh, all night. <laughs> that helps. <laughs> Rasmus, let's rock the dynamite clay. This is basically a stronghold and a matte finish will create a lot of texture and it's a good addition to the sidekick. You already mm -hmm. got a little bit of volume and texture going on. so. Right now, it's just about to get the right shape on it. It's in my hair right now. And mine as well. Easy. Nice. All right. Okay, guys, please comment down below and let us know what is your favorite hair wax. So, Rene, I used to heat it up between your palms when you're styling your hair. Yeah. All right. And then you get it uh, from the back and, and work it into the front. Or do you start with I the usually front? just dry my hands in the, in the, <laughs> off in the hair. Make sure to start from the back and then work it forward. There's a little risk that you can have, you know, parts of the wax clumping in the French fringe. <laughs> Fringes. So basically what we have done, you have got a new haircut and Rasmus styled your hair with Sidekick Zero that gives you value and hold and heat protection as well. Mm -hmm. And then we finished off the hairstyle with dynamite clay mm -hmm. to give some more texture to the hairstyle. And we gave you a little bit of a French hairstyle. And Rene, you haven't yet seen your hairstyle and you can't see it before we get you into the new set of clothes. So uh, are you looking for it? I'm excited. Let's see. All right. Cool. Let's get you in your new clothes. So Rene, now you got your new hairstyle. I think it will play very good with your new suit. We uh, bought a summer suit for you that will make you look fresh uh -huh. when you're not in the care. Then you can jump in your new set and then go out for a dinner or with your girlfriend and then have a good time and feel like a real gentleman. It's, I'm gonna try. it's a tailor fitted suit, so it will really be uh, like glued on you. You have big it's arms and, and a big um, upper body and the classic V shape. So Rasmus, are you ready? Yes, of course. All right, three, two, one. You look good. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's very you unusual know, yeah. for me, and I've actual <laughs> covered my legs too. That's pretty. Uh, that's yeah. pretty good. And now you're ready to kayak. No. Uh. <laughs> maybe, maybe for dinner. So Rene, you've got your new outfit. How do you like it? I don't know. I haven't actually seen it, so. So uh, yeah, I got a picture on my phone. We put you in some shiny black shoes and a super cool dinner jacket uh, paired with uh, matching pants and a casual white t-shirt. I like the fact that you chose a t-shirt rather than a shirt. It's very comfortable to wear. It's way more comfortable. And yeah. also some accessories. We paired um, a nice rose gold watch with your own jewelry. It has been an amazing day, a lot of adventures, hairstyling and styling. 
Now it's time for you guys to hit the like button, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. See you, Renee. That's awesome. Take care.